Evening everyone, the Lemoyne campus on edge after a burglar broke into a college townhouse early this morning and sexually assaulted a student. Syracuse police and campus security investigating. News Channel Lines Madison Moore live for us tonight from the Lemoyne campus. Madison, has there been any arrest made yet? Well, Jeff and Christy, not at this point. Syracuse police haven't even released a description of the suspect. What we do know is that the incident happened at one of these three townhouses behind me here, right on Lemoyne's campus. They're often referred to as the newer townhouses constructed back in 2014. Now, Syracuse police tell us that this incident happened early this morning around 530. The suspect entering through a window on the first floor and sexually assaulting the person inside that townhouse. It's unclear at this time whether the suspect knew the victim or if this was a random act of violence. Syracuse police telling us it's a very active case. While the majority of students have left campus for the summer, some students, such as graduate students or international students, stay in campus housing through the summer. Lemoyne did decline to comment for an on-camera interview, but sent a letter to the campus community notifying them of the incident and encouraging those on campus to take precautions. Now, those include making sure that when you swipe into a residence hall, the door closes and locks behind you. Don't let others follow you into a residence hall when swiping in. Make sure all exterior doors and windows are locked, even when you're home, and storing valuable items in a secure location. Now, if anyone has any information related to this incident, Syracuse Police is urging you to give them a call at 315-442-5200. The Lemoyne Campus Security also urging you to give them a call if you know any information. That number is 315-445-4444. Live in DeWitt, Madison Moore, News Channel 9.